Right. That's super yeah. nice. It's super nice. But so I have to mention this, okay? Because you're you're one of my favorite um, CrossFit athletes, right? And I just want to be honest with you. When I when I'm talking to the majority of people around me here, and I live in Boston, Massachusetts, so I'm in the states. When I talk to the people around me, there are the top name female athletes. Right, like they're the name female athletes everyone knows, like the Julie Fouches, and she hasn't even competed. You know, Samantha, all the David's daughters, Camila Blanc. Does that bother you at all? Do you you seem like super mellow, level headed? It doesn't seem like that's something you're even chasing. Like, but does that bother you that you're not getting? I feel like you're not getting the amount of sh- like spotlight that you should get. Is this something you even think about? Um, I. So usually I don't think about it until other people say things. And I'm sorry. A lot of, no, 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 it's not you. Like a lot of people in New York and a lot of my friends and stuff, they're like, how come, like, I mean, one example last year, I was at the Invitational and everyone except, I think me and Carol Ann Raisin Thibault were sponsored by either Reebok or Nike. And someone was like, how come neither of them have come after you yet? I'm like, I think, like, I don't know. This is just me saying my thoughts. I'm like, I think it's just because I'm not like, one of the original athletes and I'm newer. And I think a lot of people, when they think to like the CrossFit athletes, they think about the people that have been around forever. Like the names that you mentioned, they started way back when. Um, so I think that's part of it. So yes, it kind of does bother me, especially because this is the second time that I've been like the fittest American female. Exactly. The majority of like, if one country has the most CrossFit athletes out of anywhere, the U S by far. And so it's one of the, like, I was first, I was second, and then I was first. And, yeah, I don't think, like, I get near the publicity that I should get. And that's a lot of people. I think, like, my friends were so much more upset than I was because they are watching the cross State games, and they're like, you got, like, no coverage. And they're like, yeah, they might, like, show you a little bit, and then they go away, they go to somebody else. And then you might get a little bit, and then you're other way. And they're like, we hardly got to see you, especially during, like, the final event and so i think like other people make it more clear like i don't because like especially when i'm competing and stuff you don't see the coverage you're doing what you're doing um you're competing yourself and so i think it's like afterward when everyone like goes to like say these things that you're like yeah you're right so yeah so i I have to ask because yes number one I agree entirely with them because like this, this entire CrossFit games, like my eyes were carry, carry, carry. I'm like, where's carry, where's carry, where's carry. And I was thinking the same goddamn thing. I'm like, what are we talking about here? Why are we looking at the 28th place? Whatever. I'm where's carry. She'll be carry. Um, <laughs> um, if you are listening to this, that means you have just watched a clip of the everyday hero show with me and Carrie Pierce, the fittest American in the world. <laughs> Yes, that's absolutely amazing. I can't believe I landed this interview. Um, I am really sorry about the video quality of our interview. And that is, if you didn't even see the video quality, that is the reason you were just seeing pictures of Carrie Pierce or video clips of Carrie Pierce. But what I want to say is you can find the entire Everyday Hero Show interview with Carrie Pierce on my podcast, Cue the Nurse. Find it anywhere and everywhere you listen to podcasts. Um, I am super thankful that I had the interview. I am insanely pissed off that the video quality was shit, but the content is still there. Carrie Pierce, you are the goddamn shit. I cannot wait till you place in 2019's CrossFit Games. Woot woot.